Hi, welcome back to the Weekly Word Outdoor Adventures. Thanks for joining us today. We're in uh, Meigs County, Tennessee. Welcome to the Tennessee River. On the other bank is Ray County, Tennessee. We're at the site of the old Blythe Ferry. That's quite a history here. It goes way back. It was actually part of the Trail of Tears. They moved the Cherokee across on this ferry as they crossed the river here in 1828, I guess it was. But the ferry lasted until uh, almost the very end of the 20th century. Uh, I remember crossing it many times back, back in the day. And it seems like uh, it was just a slower day then. It's not near as fast as a bridge. You come here and you'd always look in the ferry boat and in, invariably it'd always be on the other side. And you'd have to wait on it to chug back across and then it'd load up seven or eight vehicles and take you back across to the other side over here. And you say, when they went away, of course, what replaced it? Well, we've got the new bridge on Highway 60 over here, as you can see, spanning the river going across. It's a lot quicker to go from Cleveland to Dayton and back now than it was back in that day. We still have lots of rivers and we still have ways to have to cross them, but uh, there's many different ways to cross them. Saw some folks fishing right up here a minute ago. We could get in a boat with a fishing boat and go across. We could, used to could ride the ferry boat. We take the bridges across, but uh, one thing to cross the river, you've got to have something uh, dependable. And as the old gospel songs say, well, one of these days we're going to get through this wilderness journey and go to the promised land, but we've got to cross Jordan to get there. And the only way to get over Jordan, that's death, uh, safely is Jesus is the bridge across there. And I know that I've placed my trust in him and I can get across. But you know one thing about it, if you were standing here needing to get across the river, you could uh, say, well, I believe uh, there's a boat over here. If, if we had a, a little John boat here, and you could say, I believe that's a good boat. You could inspect it and find out that it's worthy and everything and look, and it was watertight, and you could stand there and say, I believe that boat will get me on the other side of the river. Well, you know, you could believe till you're blue in the face, but you ain't going nowhere until you get on board. I hope you've got on board with Jesus. Here comes somebody now. We'll see you next week on the Weekly Word.